our first responders having reliable data connectivity is so important to the search and recovery efforts or taking care of their communities or providing for the safety and security of a major event. So T priority is that the world's first 5G network slice dedicated to first responders and those that support them. Uh, it is a, a dynamic slice on the network. So as surge uh, happens in these areas, that slice is not static, it's dynamic. It can expand across that network, giving responders reliable data connectivity, uh, low latency, faster speeds for that data communication that they need. And we really saw this play out uh, earlier this year in the tragic wildfires that happened in uh, Southern California and Los Angeles, uh, you had the Palisades fire and you had the Eaton wildfire. There were two command posts that were stood up for both of those wildfires. And in those command posts, uh, you had again, so many of that data technology from drones to AI enabled mapping software. So connectivity for responders was paramount. Uh, these were surge events, not just uh, you know, several responders, but thousands of responders at both of these command posts. We received an initial call uh, from uh, an agency that was using uh, tablets to check in mutual aid resources and check out mutual aid resources, track those resources. But they were congesting on their primary and secondary network. So our teams deployed T-Priority uh, enabled uh, a service for them to be able to connect their tablets and have that reliable data connectivity. Uh, we activated LA Fire Department as a T-Mobile customer. We activated over 350 uh, devices with T-Priority for LA Fire as they responded to those fires. And while less than 1% of our network was impacted, Fire does burn uh, infrastructure. So within some of those impacted areas, we did have uh, some challenges. We did have some of our network that was impacted. So there is where we deployed uh, rapidly deployable mobile assets, uh, SAC Colts, satellite cell and light trucks. And those two are enabled uh, and support T priority so that responders in that area have that reliable data connectivity.